The Electric Boat Association is the main membership organization for electric boat enthusiasts, owners, and related businesses in the United Kingdom. It was established as a branch of the Lead Development Association in London in 1982, and is the largest organization in the world dedicated to electric boats and boating. It was the first such national association. Others followed in France, Australia, the Netherlands, the USA, and Greece. Topic. Governance and organization The EBA is constituted as a member-led, not-for-profit unincorporated body, with a membership that fluctuates annually between 3 to 400 individual and business members. Members elect the office bearers at the AGM. Topic. Aims and activities The association aims to generate the revival of electric boats, including innovation in both engineering and battery technology, lower wash hull design, alongside the setting up of an infrastructure of charging points hand-in-hand -hand with the reduction of license fees and a regular participation in both boat shows and rallies on the Thames, Norfolk, the Lake District and elsewhere. Topic publications The EBA Members Magazine Electric Boat News, has progressed to a full-color magazine and recently an online magazine. The EBA also publishes a business members directory and product guide trade. Social media pages have also become important means of communication in recent years. Topic. Challenges and records The Electric Boat Association promotes and encourages competitions and challenges. The Solar Challenge Trophy was first established in 1997 and awarded that year to Malcolm Moss for his solar power channel crossing. The St. David's Trophy was donated by the former speedboat racing champion, the late Fiona, Dowager Countess of Arran. The Silver Cup is awarded for significant advance in the field of electric boating. Rear Admiral Percy Gick presented the Emsworth Trophy to the association in commemoration of the 600-mile cruise the Admiral and Mrs. Gick made in 1978 in their cruiser, Electra of Emsworth. It is a great crested grebe the Eber symbol in limewood carved and painted by Captain John Powell of Emsworth. The Emsworth Trophy is awarded to the EBA member whose boat completed the longest journey achieved during any consecutive four-month period in accordance with rules laid down and as determined by the committee. Mansura Perpetual Challenge Trophy, launched in February 2007, is for innovation in the design, development and operation of boats with hybrid or all-electric propulsion systems. The Bronze Trophy, depicting the tiller head of the 1912 hybrid motor yacht Mansura, was donated by Julian Delmer Morgan, grandson of the yacht's designer and owner, and David Barrett. Over the 2015 August Bank holiday weekend, Les Fiddler of Westview Marina Erith achieved his personal challenge of cruising from Bedford to Denver Sluice then the return trip to Erith, a distance of over 100 miles on one charge. Annie, Les and Elaine Fiddler's 27-feet cruiser has solar panels fitted to the roof to assist charging but the weather for most of the weekend included torrential rain and very little sun to be seen. In July 1997, 24-hour endurance record was set by EBA members Pat and Paul Wagstaff MBE in their 29-feet launch Wagtail V. Organized by EBA business member Thames Electric Launch Company, the record was established covering 116 miles in 24 hours on a single charge over a measured stretch of the River Thames near Goring. Four years later, Richard and Anne Leeson, EBA members, offered the classic 1899 Andrews River launch Pike for an endurance record attempt. Conducted in cooperation with the Guinness Book of Records, the record attempt was carried out over the same stretch of the Thames used in 1997 but this time the run lasted for 30 hours and covered 137 miles on a single charge.
These and other events in the progress of the Electric Boat Association have been chronicled in Kevin Desmond's 280-page illustrated history, The Electric Boat and Ship, published by McFarland Books in September 2017.